All right, all you catchers out there that ever dreamed of being a big league catcher, that's who go tell you what it's like being in the big leagues. The coach is on the road once again, bringing all you youngsters baseball, baseball, baseball. And we got the man here for the Chicago White Sox, and we're going to let him introduce himself to our Chicago audience. Yeah, my name's uh, Hector Jimenez, uh, uh, Chicago White Sox back up catcher. Yeah, and where are you from? I'm from Venezuela. Uh, this uh, second year with the White Sox, and uh, you know, just working pretty hard to, to get the job done. So, you know, I, I used to coach college baseball, and I scouted for five major league teams. Every kid's dream of playing in the big leagues. Now, you the, you the envy of every kid out there when they see you in a major league uniform. So, what does that feel like for you? Um, I think it's uh, the reality of my, of my dream, too, you know, when I was young. Um, really thankful uh, to God to be today here in the major league. Uh, like, like you say, the, the, play, the place where every kid dreamed to be uh, as a baseball player. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, like I said, just working hard to, to stay here, to, mm -hmm. to, to play in the maximum level, to, to help the team win. And it's happy to be here. So what did it start for you? What did you get that itch to want to play in the big leagues? When did it start? Uh, I was uh, fi uh, five years old. Oh, you started uh, young. Yeah, huh? yeah, really, really young when, uh, when I was back in Venezuela in my town. Uh, my dad put me in a little league team over there. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, it's, it just grew up on me, you know. Mm -hmm. The baseball grew up on my heart, and uh, I love it. I'm still loving it, and mm -hmm. uh, that's what I live for. So where did you start to know that catching was going to be your position? Actually, I was an uh, infielder. Don't uh, tell me shortstop, man. Yeah, no, no, <laughs> third baseman uh, the, most of the time. But uh, I, was, um, I wasn't that, that fast mm -hmm. to be an infielder. So uh, when I first signed as a 16 years old uh, uh, from Venezuela, they uh, decided to, to put me in the in the catching uh, position. So you had a hose behind the plate, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, uh, pretty good arm, but, uh, you know. See, uh, now Nate want to get in my shot again. <laughs> Actually, it's Addison Reed, you know. No, he, he's my boy, he's my boy, you know. He, you know, know, I'm, he know I always yeah, tease him. He, he hate me, but I love him, you know. That's, uh, that's how it is, yeah. So, so, I mean, what kind of bat did you have? Was you a hitter? Was able to hit the ball? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I still can hit it, you know. Uh, uh, but uh, uh, I know it's going to be better in the next, next couple of chances that we have. Okay. So, I mean, you know, being with the White Sox and the big leagues, I mean, what is this whole experience like for you? Uh, pretty good, you know, be, be, being here with uh, all this guy, uh, better than with uh, a lot of experience, uh, <clears throat> enjoying it, you know, trying to learn the most I can. Uh, and. Uh, you know, it's, it's been good. It's been good. Uh, like I said, you know, I, I know I'm positive. We, we want to be better, and we, we want to start winning some games. So, I mean, now that you got, are you still getting rookie treatment, or you got the rookie treatment behind you? Uh, I think, <laughs> I think, <laughs> I, I, I think I, I, I'm gonna take it. You know, <clears throat> whatever, whatever they got for me and the, and the rookie, uh, whatever they do for the rookies, you know, I, I'm gonna take it. That's how it is, and uh, uh, I'm gonna take it with. So you still I mean, know not you still know not to be the first one in the child line. Huh? Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I think, yeah. So I mean, when you look back on your hometown, you go back home. Are you still a local hero now? Uh, not really. You know, I don't feel like uh, like I'm most the anybody in this world. Uh, you know, I just try to be humble as I can. Uh, try to help people that, that they need my help, especially in my in my town. You know, a lot of poor people. Try, yeah. try to help them a little bit. Uh, you know, just go there and spend time with my family. You know, that's what I do. Coach, take your youngsters behind the scenes with the man Hector. Appreciate it. Thank you, man. Talk to me with the coach, Mike. We made as we're on the road. Bring your baseball, baseball, baseball.